Modifying array elements is not too difficult, and it's very similar to accessing array elements in that we are going to use the same thing. We're going to use the index of each of those spots to access what's in there and change it. So in order to modify an element's value, I might do something like this, where I say fruits index 1 equals watermelon. And if you're thinking that the new array will look like this, apple, watermelon, and cherry, then you're correct. Because what I've done here is I've actually said whatever is in spot 1 or index 1 of the fruits array, let's turn that into or let's replace that with the value watermelon. And that's the easiest way if you know the index of, of a value that you want to replace that's the easiest and most direct way of changing the value of an array. And you can change it to anything. I could have put a number there or uh, something that's not a fruit. The array doesn't really care what I put there. So if we're taking a look at this in code, what I can say is uh, let's change fruits, fruits, Let's change what is in index 2, and I'm going to change that back to cherry, because that's what we had there before. And then let's print the whole array again, so we can see what we've got going on there. As you can see, orange has now changed to cherry. So that's... That's how easy it is if you know the index 0, 1, 2 to change that element to something new.